Hey guys, this is Brian Tech TV. How are you? Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to make normal maps in uh, Blender 3D. Now this is a very, very easy process, but you must have a decent system to bear the uh, detail if you want good normal maps. Okay, so to start off, we're going to start off with a plane. Okay. Now, we go down here to our materials button and hit add new. To the very far right, you'll see a texture panel. Click Add New. Okay, now we click on the uh, texture panel buttons, or just press F6. Now you'll see a little window that says Texture Type. Click Image. Let me make this bigger for you guys. Okay. Now we're gonna go over here and split area, and go. We're gonna change from 3D view to UV Image Editor. Okay, now and for Mac users, you have to press Shift what? Shift F6 for Mac users. Sorry about that. Okay, now what we're going to do? This will be the actual mo model represent. Uh, sorry about that. This will be the model that you'll use to bake the uh, normal map to. Okay. Now, we're going to load in the uh, texture. So you open it up in your directory. I'll be posting the uh, texture I use on uh, Photo Bucket so you guys can get it. Alright, so we're going to use this image right here. Okay. Now you see it's right there in the preview. Now we're going to go back over to our material buttons. First thing we want to hit texture like we want to go all right now we do lamp and then hemi click on shaders and turn on your specularity okay now that's done we want to click on the model hit tab this will put you in edit mode now hit subdivide by pressing W and just subdivide it as many times as you can okay that's enough for me okay now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into editing okay now you'll see mesh tools and you'll see a button called noise press that a couple of times you'll notice that your model begins to look weird like that so we go over to link and materials and hit set smooth Okay. There we go. We now have a. Now we have our model. Okay. Next thing you're going to do is add a camera to your scene. At, bring that up towards the light. Um, you want to make sure that the um, the dotted lines are e evenly matched up with the uh, model. Okay, now you're going to hit space, pre uh, add mesh, plane. This is going to be your texture. Okay, we're going to go into wireframe, and what we're going to do is hit tab on the uh, selected model you have, hit unwrap. Do not click on the model that we're about to bake. You want to click on the, uh, stand the un unnoised plane. Okay, go over to image, new, 1024 by 1024, make sure it's black. Hit OK. Alright, now get out of edit mode, click on the um, mesh, and then click on your plane. Go to the rendering area, click bake. And now we're going to click normals. You're going to click selected to active, and where it says camera, we're going to hit tangent. And I'm going to pause this video, and what you do is you hit bake, and I'll unpause it when it's done baking. Okay guys, this is your final result for the uh, normals. Now, okay, here's what we're going to do. We are going to go into a second layer. Okay. Make sure you're centered, and we're going to add a new plane. Go to textured mode, and add a lamp hemi. The hemi lamp will show your normals really well. Okay, now click on your plane. Go over to your Blender materials. Add new. 
go to texture, add new, go to your textures button, shift F6, or just F6 for Windows users. Click image, and load in your normal map. Now you'll see this right here. We want to go back to uh, materials and click shader and turn spe uh, specularity all the way to zero in your shaders. Okay, now we're going to go to map input and make a UV. Now go into edit mode and unwrap your plane. And we're going to scale this up. Okay, now we have that. Let's scale it up a little more. Okay, now we're going to go to map two. We're going to take our color and hit normal. Oh, I forgot to tell you something. When you're over in texturing, make sure you hit normal map tangent. That will make sure it actually turns on normal maps. Wait a second. Okay. What we're going to do now, you can see the uh, normal map right there very faintly. We're going to have to fix this. Go over to textures and click on a second layer. Add new texture image. Load in the uh, path. Now, as you can see, it's not the size as our other one. So what we do, we go back to materials, go to map input, UV, and there we go. Everything's set now. And now you can see the bump map right through here. See, there's the normal map if you can't see that. Um, okay, so that's a quick tutorial for Mac and Windows users on how to make a um, normal map. This is a correct normal map, um, as you can tell. So, um, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and if you have the chance, please check out RJ Fire's channel. Um, he's the guy who just pointed out that Mac users had the uh, Shift F6. Um, I appreciate you guys for your time, and uh, my next tutorial will be soon. Alright guys, bye.